warm Cuban welcome to our first team of the night, Regional Song! Tim, I woke up this morning with a crazy look in my eye. Yeah? <laughs> well, Jeff, you do that every day. <laughs> but this one was different. Really? <laughs> when I jutted out to the left, as opposed to the usual drift to the right. <laughs> <laughs> Metaphorically speaking. Okay. <laughs> Were you thinking about uh, what you want our family to like do with our future again? Or? Yeah. To an extent, if me as a individual counts as family. Are you, are you trying to leave the family again? I'm thinking of Tanks you saw right through. <laughs> uh, Bob and Dad aren't gonna like that. Every single Thursday dinner you're like, you know what? I'm having with the family. I'm off on my own. It'd be cool if you learned how to make a dish to help us all out. I do the salad. I can do a salad. Maybe do a salad. I mean it this time. I, I was looking at a college pamphlet. <laughs> a college pamphlet. <laughs> yes, a college pamphlet. Let me guess. James Madison University. Yes. You saw it in my room, didn't you? I did. I didn't say anything. I did, because I was waiting for Thursday. <laughs> when you were like, hey, Mom and Dad, I'm going to go on hikes in Harrisonburg. <laughs> so I'm that predictable, is that, is that it? You are certainly not spontaneous. <laughs> oh yeah? What if I pour gas on my head and light it on fire? Oh, that's cute. I'm going to go up to my room and journal a little bit before the <laughs> Okay? Yeah, I was thinking of starting a journal too. Yeah. <laughs> Start one, don't talk about it. <laughs> the 
there's more out there than this pizza kitchen we have in our kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> You'll see. I'm gonna do something crazy. <laughs> hey there, kiddo! You muttering to yourself oh, again? Dad. No. Oh. Another long day at the Richmond Times. Let me tell you. I heard the paper's doing well. Paper's doing well. They gave me a column. It's about uh, family life. So if you don't mind, I'll be having a recorder at the table this evening. <laughs> well, good, because they can hear my statement. It's an official statement that I am I'm emancipating and going to college. I, I guess I'm not sure to emancipate at 18. No, you, I mean, Technically, you can't. I can handle the fact checking for that, of course. Though, but, um, this is good. This feels nice. It feels like you're feeling pretty strong. I uh, just, just. Yeah? Yeah, yeah! Okay. Yeah. A son under the gun. Making moves he cannot back up. This is going to sell well. This is for your newspaper? Even the Richmond Times. We were talking about it. Do you always have to write? Uh, you don't, but you know what? It's like, better if you do. I'm going to join the Coast Guard. Let's try to get a drink. Bringing work home can be a pain. <laughs> it's always you, Dad. That's part of what drove me to the Coast Guard. It was something I've been thinking about a long, long time. <laughs> really? Because you never put work down. Look at you. There's a pencil in your ear. <laughs> Try writing this down. The silence of me walking out of this room. Don't do anything rash. Write these it's down, Dad. Write these down. Oh, come on. Come on. <laughs> what a salad. <laughs> <laughs> Just turn the light on. Okay. If it's too brown, scream or something. <laughs> I still make a lot of money. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oké, oké, nee. Ah ja. Can I have a with you? I'm in an AP econ class. Of course you know, like macro and micro. Well, I was so glad you're not doing so That's <laughs> I'm not my dad. I'm not my dad. I'm not going to sit here and write down everything you no, say. I don't make as much money as I did when I was on the Philadelphia Eagles. I remember <laughs> those days. I remember those days. We went to the game. And I couldn't play, and they, they had to sit in the stands because it's all <laughs> joke the gas. <laughs> <laughs> I remember Uncle Nate. I remember my dad was like, this will be real nice for the paper. You know my dad actually wrote a column that night about a man who thinks he's on the Eagles but isn't? Did you know that? That's yeah. weird. What is it about? It's about you, Nate. You put that in the newspaper. He's a selfish prick sometimes. So I guess the jig is up. If you're looking at it through a lens of just yourself, the jig is up. So you know I didn't invent the board game? <laughs> you know how I figured that out, Uncle Nate? No. I went to a spend the night in third grade, and a kid brought out Monopoly. And I was like, my uncle invented that. Yeah. I was so happy to show him, and he showed me the fucking patent license. <laughs> <laughs> the game that was created before you were born. I suppose that could make a better board game. <laughs> Can I level with you? This salad isn't even good. My dad is so immersed with work, he doesn't realize that I just put ketchup in mustard. I wanted to impress him. <laughs> he always looked up to me as the little guy. I was just a big homeless loser. You're not a loser. He can't take a World Cup match from his own butt. Uncle Nate. <laughs> Sorry. Pardon my friend. It's okay. Which I also don't speak. I know I told you I speak. No, it's gibberish. I've been taking some myself, and I can say that you need aid, which is help. <laughs> I do have aid. <laughs> anyway. What? I'm gonna do it. Well, you say, Uncle, what? You have needs. What I said before I didn't have AIDS, I was not lies. <laughs> you can just do me one thing or don't tell my dad. He's gonna do a right at He'll write it. Hey, don't forget about me now. I'm not going to be back down for dinner. I'll be right here. What were you and the son talking about? Um, I, I cranked out a column, by the way. I cranked out a column. It's called Crazy Family. It's called The Family. It's about me, and it's about someone who comes over every night and we help them out. Have you ever considered like, writing like, Reporting or not writing this about your family? Well, I used to try and talk about society, but it didn't go so well in Richmond because everyone has better opinions than I do. Who does it? Me. So Me? long, brother. I'm going to hit the old dusty trail. What are you talking about? The oh. dinner will be on at 15. You can come right back. It's gross. <laughs> I love that sign. Family is good, so is your career. <laughs> so is everyone reminded. Dad? I thought I couldn't do it. You're a Coast Guard elite. <laughs> Stop it, Dad. Stop it. Wait, no. Wait. I'm actually going to follow up with Tim. What? Are you be back at the dinner table, sir? I want to go join the stock market if I go Tim. <laughs> he doesn't. He hasn't had that money. Yeah, it's because the market's down. He's <laughs> saying, sure, <laughs> but come back up. No. <laughs> All of a sudden, you care. You're just scared of me either. I mean, sort of. Dad! Dad! We're all tired of you writing stories about home. What? <laughs> Listen to him, Dad. You guys are my sons. Dinner's fun. Dinner's no fun. 
Right? Yeah, yours sucks. <laughs> <laughs> Tell him what you really want. He's right. The dinner is dying because you need to know what you're talking about. Chicken is gross. <laughs> <laughs> Uncle Nate, the stock market's gonna bump up, right? That was all bullshit. <laughs> I told you. I told you. Uncle Nate doesn't know what he's doing. But you know what he does know? He knows how to stick his neck out there. <laughs> <laughs> see? See? Guys, stop! Stop! I can't take it! Relax. Dad? <laughs> <laughs> Here's a fucking column for you. Don't do it. I journal. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>